Welcome back. Today we're doing some fall projects that nobody wants to do. Had to get the septic tank pumped, so we've had to dig up all of the stuff. Luckily, it wasn't very deep underground or hard to get to. Now, this is a project you can't be put on a list. It can't be put off for a week at a time. After being put on a list with other companies, finally we got a hold of ABF Pumping and they took care of it. After the pumping was done, we had to bury it again and put it back so we could find it again easily. Now that that's done, time for the second project. It's cold outside, time to take care of the pump okay. house. Okay, here's the pump house. And we I can hear the heater running. Yeah, we're going to turn that down. We're going to replace the heat bulb so the heater don't have to come on. Now this project requires us to remove the lid, luckily an easy process, and to remove the insulation. Now it looks like we have a leak, so we'll have to replace some caulking. If everything else is in order, it should be as easy as to replace a heat bulb. Take the 250 watt infrared bulb heat lamp out. We're only going to replace the 250 with a more economical but efficient bulb. It stays pretty warm in here. 125. Okay. Um, make sure no cords are hanging near it because one year we actually did have a, a cord burn in half and stop our water supply because it was sitting on the bulb. So we want to make sure everything's away from there. And turn it on. And turn it on. Thank you yeah. for reminding me. Now we have a sensor over here by the pump that picks up what the temperature is. See that little white thing on the, on the board? It's actually a receiver, a uh, transmitter that tells us what the temperature is out here. And we have the uh, receiver in the house so we can always see what the temperature is in the pump house. Okay, and we put a piece of styrofoam under the lid and then we slide the lid back on in place. We have dirt down in each one of these concrete blocks to keep it more insulated. Hold on just a minute. I'll get the lid back on. It needs to be replaced one of these days. That'll be another project. But we're going to go inside and see what the temperature is on the receiver. Okay, here's our temperature in here. And then this is what it is in our pump house. So right now it's 55.9 degrees. So <clears throat> we can come in here anytime and check to see what the temperature is in the pump house. Thank you for watching. We hope this helps you with any of your similar projects. Don't forget to like and subscribe, leave any comments, and as always, God bless.